Welcome back traders. This is Sandra with Trading Made Simple. Today I wanted to go over um, how traders can profit from the Fitch downgrade of the U.S. bonds and uh, SPY, QQQ, and uh, IWM, the three tickers to short if the market declines after this downgrade. Now look, this just happened today after the market closed. So don't you dare think that we're not going to be seeing something happen tomorrow. This only happened one time in the past, in 2011. And when that happened, uh, the Dow Jones Industrial Average fell by 200 points on the day of the downgrade. And S&P fell over 10% the following month. Okay, so we need to keep this in mind as uh, retail traders. This is significant. It's a significant event, and it reflects a loss in confidence in the United States' ability to manage its finances. However, it also creates opportunities for traders who are prepared. So by the way, I just finished this article for Benzinga. I'm currently a content creator for Benzinga as well, and so this is important to me, and I wanted to get this out into a video for our members as well as uh, people who follow my channel. So if you're liking this type of content, please like, subscribe, and share. I know it's very time sensitive. I do appreciate you being here. So how can you profit from this event? Uh, here are some ways that you can profit from this news event, okay? You can sell short. We already know this, right? If you're a stock uh, seller, you know that you can uh, sell stock short. For us option traders, we're going to buy puts. Now remember the three main tickers, ETFs, SPY, QQQs, IWM. You could just focus on those if you wanted to. You, didn't, you don't have to make this difficult, okay? I also am a proponent of automation. This will really help you if you have a full-time job, going to school, taking care of a family. If you can automate taking profits like with a trail stop. Awesome. If you don't know how to do that, go to my channel. I have a ton of automation videos for you to review for free. Okay, now the other thing too, by the way, outside of selling stock, uh, buying put options is also to trade volatility. The downgrade is likely to increase volatility in the stock market. Traders who can trade volatility can profit from this increase. Okay, so what happened in 2011 that can give you some context of what may happen today? Now, granted, you know, our past doesn't always like repeat itself, but oftentimes it's very similar. So keep in mind, these were the tickers that uh, were really thought of as safe investments. And during that downgrade in 2011, Apple went down uh, 10%. On the day of the downgrade, that would be tomorrow, people. Google, 8%. Uh, JP Morgan Chase Bank, 7%. Wells Fargo, 6%. Microsoft, 5%. These stocks were all considered to be relatively safe, uh, so their declines were a sign that investors were becoming more cautious. And then um, tickers that you can profit from today. So. There are a lot of traders out there that just don't like to short stock. They don't like to uh, trade uh, options by buying puts. And if you'd rather, you can definitely uh, get an ETF, of course, that does the opposite of that. There are plenty of ETFs uh, that you can actually buy that actually short the market. Uh, so take a look at that as well as what? TLT. The iShares 20-year Treasury bond ETF is a popular way to invest in long-term U.S. Uh, Treasury bonds. If investors become more risk-adverse, they may be more likely to buy TLT. Something to consider. How about gold? Gold and silver, right? The Spider Gold Trust ETF is a popular way to invest in gold. Gold is often seen as a safe haven asset, so investors become more worried about the U.S. economy they may be more likely to buy gold. All right, and if you don't already know the VIX, the VIX is a measure of implied volatility. It's considered the fear gauge. Uh, the S&P 500, if it, 
If a downgrade leads to increased volatility in the stock market, the VIX could rise. This could lead to profits for traders who are shorting volatility. The downgrade to AA plus is a significant event. It does not mean that stock market is doomed. Traders who are prepared and use the right strategies can still make money during this time. As option traders especially, we love volatility. It doesn't matter what direction you can go to. If, if the direction is up, down, or sideways, it's all good. And we like volatility. So by following the strategies outlined that we talked about above, um, you could profit from the downgrade of U.S. bonds. Uh, it's important to note that these are just a few examples of stocks that could be affected by the downgrade tomorrow. Traders should always do their due diligence before making any investment decisions. And by the way, if you don't know, I teach um, a whole bunch of different strategies uh, that you can profit from in different market environments. TradingMadeSimple.org. You can reach me every trading day. 714-202-7361. That's right. I'll answer. All right. This was a quick and fast lesson only because this is time sensitive. It's happening tomorrow and we'll see you in the next video.